I'm Kurt McCardle, I'm from the UK and I've lived in Hohot for five years. I'm an English teacher and vlogger and I've been vlogging for about uh, six months in Hohot, just trying to show people this city, the city that not many people know about. Good morning in Zhao Shanghao from the village of Gurtzalao to the southeast of Hohot in Inner Mongolia. And the Inner Mongolian sun is shining today, we're very lucky. There's lots of things in place for people to express themselves artistically or try new things. When we were in the community center, there was a full wall of books, just free for anyone to take a look, practice their reading. And when we went into the calligraphy class, that a guy instantly wanted me to, to have a go, wanted to teach me how to do this Chinese calligraphy. Because uh, the GDP per capita, you know, for the people uh, has risen, people have more expendable income and more leisure time. When I first went to one and went to a shop, I had like cash with me because I thought they're not going to have WeChat pay. I can't pay with my phone in a village. And then they showed me QR codes. Like, oh, well, I'm not going to have internet, surely. Oh, I've got 4G. Anyway, Miss Lay's going to show us around the house. So let's see what a local village house is like. One of the things I find most interesting in the house is the solar panels. Things like the solar power that they're, that they're implementing all across China and trying to cut down on, on emissions. That is not to benefit one person, but that's to benefit the world, to benefit Chinese people and future, future generations. When visiting villages and hearing villages tell their stories, um, I was most impressed with China's achievement at reducing poverty and, and building the Shukang society or the moderately prosperous society in all respects. I can't think of many changes on the planet that have been greater than that, you know. When I read the articles, it didn't surprise me. Because I think when, when China sets its mind to something, everybody gets behind it. And you know, when, when China says, we're gonna, we're gonna do this for everyone, it happens.